hello guys and welcome to my channel in this video i'm gonna show you a quick way on how to load uh hair in a sequencer for metahumans right so we're gonna add daniel uh we're gonna uh remove this rig we don't need it you can leave it but we don't need it we want to add an animation okay and now we're gonna open our metahuman And here we're going to create a new variable, right? We're going to call it hair length and it's going to be a float. We're going to expose this to cinematics so we can uh, update this value in uh, sequencer. And we're also going to create an event. Custom event. And we're gonna call this update hair right and uh, now we're gonna take our hair groom component set hair length scale right and uh, we're gonna input our hair length uh, variable right Okay, now that we have exposed uh, that variable to the sequencer, we can add it here in uh, the track list, right? And uh, we can uh, add a new key here. We can add a new key here uh, with the value of one. And then we will make it again to value of zero, right? So the hair will grow to the maximum and then to the minimum again, right? <laughs> okay. And next thing we want to do is to add an event. We want to add a repeater, right? We want this event to... Oh, let me, let me remove this. Let's start from the beginning and add the event now it's easier add event repeater right so now we have this event starting from frame one or from frame zero to the end right we're gonna double click on it and uh we're just gonna call update here okay and uh, now the next thing uh, we can do is right click on this event properties and call in editor as well so we can see the changes here in uh, editor sequence all right so let's test it out and this is it it's pretty easy there might be other ways to achieve this but uh, i find this super easy to do It's uh, amazing how easy and uh, how much stuff you can uh, do with this uh, full feature, right? So this is it, guys, for this video. It's just a short video because uh, some people ask me how, uh, how to do this. And uh, here it is, right? Bye.